apologize in advance for this. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> really, I <laughs> Yesterday, when I'm writing these at home, I never thought they, I mean, I'm just writing privately. I, I kind of forget there are people reading, and I never thought I'd read this out loud. Um, yesterday, this is called Say Stirrups, or as Scott likes to call it, gynomite. <laughs> Yesterday, I received a friendly phone call from my gynecologist office reminding me about my appointment today, like I could forget. It was like a dark cloud hanging over my week, and I was well aware that on Thursday, I'd be hitting the stirrups. I was instructed to arrive 10 minutes early as they were converting their files to a new electronic system, and I would need to fill out paperwork and have my picture taken. Okay, wait, what? <laughs> picture? I hope they meant a picture of my face and not my vagina. <laughs> Surely my doctor, who I think is fantastic, wasn't using file photos of his patient's anatomy to identify. <laughs> or maybe he was, kind of like flashcards? <laughs> was a picture really all that necessary? What did they need a picture for? Who did they think they were? The gynecological BMV? Were they gonna hand me a license? A license to operate a vagina? After three kids, I'm pretty sure I'm vaginally legit. However, seeing as that I really liked my doctor, I figure I would cooperate. Cooperation proved, though, proved to be difficult. As I got dressed, I didn't know what to wear for my gyneco gynecologist's file photo. This isn't the type of fashion situation I've ever seen addressed in InStyle. Would this be a full body shot, shoulders up? It felt a little like school picture day. I changed my outfit three times. I felt like Goldilocks trying to get it just right. Only there wasn't a porridge or warm bed in my future, just a pap smear. It turns out the photo wasn't any big deal. It wasn't even a real camera. It looked like a scanner. And the receptionist didn't even get out of her seat. She scanned me through her front plexiglass window like a barcode. <laughs> really? I didn't even get to say cheese or stirrups? Some photo shoot this turned out to be major disappointment. I might have taken a wrong turn somewhere in life. I must have made a wrong decision somewhere along the way because somehow the decisions I have made have led me to being disappointed by the photo shoot at my gynecologist. <laughs> oh, well, at least I had that pap smear to cheer me up. <laughs>